I wanted to make a quick video on those that are on the path and they are dealing with karmic situations, karmic people, people that are in your life right now that are creating some challenges. I, I know that some of the challenges seem like it's endless and there's no hope. But I want to address dealing with your situation and dealing with these people with integrity and causing as little damage to yourself and your karmic person. Sometimes karmic people can't see the light and they're so stuck in the darkness and and these negative energies of jealousy, um, anger, revenge, greed. wanting to win and I know a lot of you are in the thick of it and it and it seems difficult and sometimes you don't want to take the high road but you definitely it would be beneficial for you to work on yourself and Think, really think before you act. And if you're dealing with karmic situations, before you react, before you respond, definitely take the time to always practice the golden rule. When you go back to the golden rule, do unto others as you would have them do unto you. When you see people choose the wrong path or make the wrong wrong decisions maybe not the wrong decisions for them because that's what they're where they're at it's up to you to have the understanding i'm not saying you have to forgive their actions at the moment and a lot of people have different mixed feelings about forgiveness and i i'm not discussing forgiveness today some people have done some really horrible, horrible things with bad intentions. People have been stolen from, cheated on, betrayed, lied to. Those are all the negative emotions. And I did make a video before about hurt people, hurt people, hurt others, hurt people, hurt other people. And so I'm not saying giving people a pass the ones that are not being nice and kind, they won't compromise. They can't find a common ground with you. Sometimes the best thing to do is just walk away. Sometimes the best thing is to just turn the other cheek, right? Turn the other cheek and And take the higher road. Believe it or not, you have your spiritual team that can help you. So you don't need to take revenge. You don't need to, you know, it doesn't have to be a tit for tat, right? You could ask your spiritual team, your ancestors, ascended masters, God, to help you and sometimes if you don't know what to do and you haven't gotten 